I got bad news for everyone. And it's not the, the salmon burger I just ate. Um, it's that I keep getting these comments on my channel where I talk about restricted Pokemon and people keep saying, Marcos, Giratina is good. Giratina is good. And I'm like, I guarantee you, I, I guarantee you it's not. It straight up isn't. So today, we're testing it. <laughs> I made a Giratina team and you might be thinking, Marcos, you can't be serious. You got the Tapu Bulu. Listen, I will straight up say Tapu Bulu is absolutely cracked in series 10 and people haven't figured it out yet. The recovery, the snarl tech, the fact that you get terrain up regardless is really nice, especially on Trick Room. Like literally only run Bulu if you have Trick Room as an option in my opinion. But that isn't the star of the show today and I would hardly call this thing a star. We're using Giratina Origin. Giratina Origin just seems, thank you for the follow, uh, just seems like a waste of a Pokemon in my opinion. So you have to hold the Grissy Sword, which does give you extra damage on your ghost and dragon type attacks. Because you only have 120. Like, you're very bulky, right? We only have 120 in each of those. Uh, so I'm only really getting a boost on my Shadow Ball. I have to run Earth Power for Stagataka, Incineroar, and Zacian. And I used to have a modest set, but I miscalculated the speed tier, and I apparently have to hit 149 to outspeed Caloric Shadow at minus 1. And since I'm already running Reggie Alecky with a Magnet, I might as well do that. So I switched over to Timid, and I'm just not doing as much as I wish I could. But it does get some pretty nice moves. Will-O-Wisp is cool. This guy is actually calced to live a Life Orb, Timid, Calyrex, Shadow, Astro Barrage. So that's pretty awesome. But yeah, I'm just doing my best to make this thing viable. <laughs> it's really just like a bulk thing. You got to put Dazzling Gleam on Bulu over Woodhammer. I literally see no reason to run Dazzling Gleam over Woodhammer. Urshifu Dark's on the way out. And Woodhammer is absurdly powerful with terrain. Because I'm running Horn Leech. Like, there's a big jump in power there. Like, I can't justify running Dazzling Gleam on a four special attack type of Bulu. Because Snarl isn't there to do damage. Snarl's there to support the team. So I'm, I'm running I'm running Woodhammer. It's so strong. Uh, but yeah. I, I would run Destiny Bond on this. I'm, I'm talking to chat for anyone watching YouTube. I am I would run Destiny Bond on this. But it just doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right. Having a restricted that just just gets KO'd and it's meant to get KO'd. That just seems like a waste. So yeah, uh, running the Bulu and Incineroar set from the Necrozma Dust main team. We got Focus Sash or Shoe Rapid Strike to help out versus um, opposing Incineroar, which are actually pretty annoying for Giratina and Tapu Bulu. I will say one thing Giratina does really well is it actually like just has a decent typing for dealing with a lot of Pokemon. It hard walls Landorus Eye of all Pokemon. Landorus Eye, what does it run? Earth Power, not affected. Rock Slide, not doing that much. Sludge Bomb, completely resisted. Like that is, I don't know, man. Anyways, uh, but yeah, Giratina, <laughs> Urshifu. Stack Attack, I would Safety Goggles because we have a horrible, horrible, horrible Xerneas matchup without this thing. This thing's holding our team together. Like it's like it's glue and duct tape. And we have Magnet Reggie Lucky, the biggest glue of all. And I trust this Pokemon so much, I'm gonna sign in to my patented Pokey Physicist account where I test all of my all of my teams that I'm super, super confident in. I'm definitely this is definitely the account that I test my teams I'm super confident in. Look at that. <laughs> super confident in this one, I swear. We're not using the alt because I'm scared. Why use Giratina when you can use Dragapult? Exactly. Exactly. This video was a lesson to everyone commenting on my channel saying Giratina isn't D tier. It's bad. It's so bad. Like, I'm going to make it look usable is my goal today. But that's, it's going to be a struggle and you're going to see me cry like five times. Anyways. Let's do this. <laughs> uh, are you guys ready to not have a, not have a good time? We're on low ladder, by the way. Obviously, we just signed into the alt account. Uh, and this is not a bad matchup whatsoever. I'm going to lead off uh, Aleki Giratina. We definitely want Stack Attacka here. Stack Attacka annihilates most of their team, barring this thing. And I think I'm going to bring the... I think Incineroar is fine. Okay, yeah. So, I mean, I can just... Get out of there. Protect. Because I just go for the Snarl and the Volt Switch on the Incineroar here. I'm not going to bother. <laughs> I'm not going to bother giving this thing weakness policy. You know, you know they're running that. They're not running Life Orb. 
If they if they do reveal Life Orb, then I will Thunderbolt it next turn, but I'm very confident they're not. I'm pretty sure they're weakness policy. Yeah, Giratina is a cool design and all, right? It's like it, it feels like the Edge Lord's favorite legendary, but it's so meh. All right, please be Life Orb. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. It's time to do the thing. Time to KO your Moltres. What you gonna do? Oh. What you gonna do? You gonna switch? No, you're not. You cannot switch. Parting shot. Ah, uh, uh. <laughs> I could also Volt Switch, but I'm not confident that'll KO. Uh, am I faster? Because I can. My Incinera will live then. Or my Aleki will live. So I don't know if I'm faster. I'm gonna Parting Shot this thing and I'm gonna Thunderbolt. Because it's just it just feels right. There's a Sogalio. I'll take the damage. I'll take the damage. They had to switch out there. They're so Aleki weak. Look how much we did. Look how much we did to that thing. Get in here, Giratina. Time to be useless. Being the best you you can be, which is useless. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and Electroweb Shadow Ball, and that should do it. Unless they're like Specs. Actually, am I faster than this thing? 163. I'm probably not. I should probably Volt Switch. It's probably... I don't think it's AV. But yeah, I'm still going to get this KO. I don't know what they're... Maybe they think I'm physical. That'll KO. Giratina gets a KO. Check it out. If it doesn't get a KO, this is the most depressing thing I've ever seen. Giratina gets a KO. <laughs> he is shadow balling, yeah. He is straight up balling at the moment. Respectfully. <laughs> Gear, the, the title of this video, Giratina Balls, respectfully. <laughs> it's the dumbest thing ever. <laughs> um, whose Intimidate went first? I guess I won't know. Uh, I mean, I live the hit. I can just... Yeah. yeah I don't... I don't... Ooh. I'm to Snarl, I suppose. Market parting shot. It doesn't really matter. I get parting shots safer. Because I get in the Aleki. Giratina balls, respectfully. <laughs> hey, we get the special defense drop too. Incinera lives. We get the parting shot off. In comes a Reggie Aleki. They are scary. I'm going to Shadow Ball you. And I'm also going to Volt Switch on it. Because I don't think they stay in with Finny. I think they go back into Incinera. Yeah. I'm going to Shadow Ball Volt Switch. Or I could... Yeah, I don't want to lose my Aleki this early. Yeah, they protect. Nice. So hopefully I don't miss this, because getting two KOs would be pretty baller for this guy. Don't miss. Don't miss, you garbage Pokemon. Don't miss. I told you to ball respectfully, but you're just straight up disrespecting me now. He's just straight up disrespecting me now. Stop disrespecting me. I hate this game. Uh, Thunderbolt into Earth Power should KO. So what I can do is I can protect here, get in my, my Giratina, and then go for the KO on the Incineroar. Dude, I checked to see if Giratina could learn Meteor Beam, because then maybe it'd have a, a niche, but it just doesn't. It just straight up doesn't. I'll Volt Switch Earth Power, actually. Yep, easy. Boom. He's Citrus. He loves this. He definitely loves this. Uh, I do have Fake Out now, which is nice, so I can just Shadow Ball Fake Out. He loves that. Yeah. <laughs> Not very respectful. Not very respectful at all. Uh, maybe I just get rid of this thing, honestly. Yeah, I can just Earth Power here, and it's I can Shadow Ball too in case they switch out. It doesn't make a difference. I'll fake out you. I'll Shadow Ball you. It doesn't. It literally. Yeah, give me that. <laughs> give me that. Not that it mattered that I Shadow Balled there. It, it straight up didn't matter. And next turn, I just double down this Incineroar. Snarl. Because they got to give me something. And I don't think I get KO'd from this range. Honestly, I don't. I really don't think I get KO'd. Did they just do that? Hey, 
Hey, special defense drop. That's what we needed. And they missed. That's what you get. That's what you get. Give me the snarl. Did I miss my snarl? Good, I didn't. They forfeit. Nice. Okay. Just some hyper offense rain stuff with uh, Zacian. Funny enough, uh, this seems like a pretty good Giratina game. Which feels absurd to say. It feels absurd just saying that out loud. Uh, I can lead off with... Hmm. I think I lead off like this, and I just double protect turn one. I definitely want Incineroar in the back. I'm actually gonna go Tapu Bulu here. Okay, yeah, I can I can respectfully ball with this. I can respectfully ball with this. I'm gonna Shadow Ball here and get in my Tapu Bulu because there's no real point. They're just gonna fake out. Actually, no, I outspeed you. I should about speed you. I freaking yeah. Ludicolo bad. Respectfully, obviously. And their their life orb. Yeah, they died of the they died of thunderbolt now. I could uh yeah they died of the thunderbolt. I could even bolt switch and it might KO. I think I'll do this. I think I think I'll double here. Yeah, respectfully. <laughs> there we go. I didn't even get to pick up the KO on the Gothitel. How much would that have done? How much would that have done? It, I guarantee you it doesn't KO. Gothitel. Yeah, no, we do half. That's so Ooh, sad. Our worst matchup. Our worst matchup. Uh, I mean, I'm guaranteed to live this hit. I think what I'm going to do is lead off Reggie Alecki. If they lead off with, like, Mian Xiao plus Calyrex Shadow Rider, I actually get a free KO here. Granted, they don't crit, which is really funny. It's it's the funniest thing that could happen. Because I protect my, my Reggie Alecki and go for, the, go for the KO on this thing. Uh, in the back, I definitely feel pretty comfortable once everything... Once, you know, this thing's gone. Is yeah, I want to bring the Incineroar. And I think I'll bring the Stack Attack... Can I get the lead I want? Mian Xiao, Calyrex? Uh, I'll take it. Respectfully, obviously. Ooh, actually, it depends. If they double the Giratina, I don't live this. I think what I do is I, I try it. Or I protect and I go hard into Incineroar. And the next turn I fake out Shadow Ball. And that's the safest way of doing it. Electroweb. As they reveal Life Orb Ditto. Absurd. Absurd. Stupid even. And they're not Life Orb on this thing, which means I always live. Yeah, give me that. Respectfully. <laughs> That's so stupid. It's so stupid. Where's the Entei? Um... Tech parting shot. Suppose that's fine. They're pressure Entei too. No, I can I can intimidate them. What am I doing? Uh, I think I just give them the Giratina now. Er, mm. I'll parting shot. I'll parting shot the yeah, because life or Baleki sounds scary. That's fine. If I go Aleki here, I can Electroweb. Hopefully I win the speed tie. That'd be huge. No, he wins the speed tie. I should still be faster than Entei, I think. Unless it's like Scarf. Yep. And yeah, I was actually faster regardless, which is nice. And now I think I win if I just reverse the speed tiers right here by going for Trick Room. And focus down their Entei, which 
They shouldn't be able to KO me. Actually, Life Orb Thunderbolt's gonna come close. It's just it's just a matter of speed tie. As they actually Thunderbolt the stack attack, which is not their play ever, in my opinion. And there's the Rillaboom. I might have lost. I might have lost. Depends if they fake out. Yeah, I lost. <laughs> I lost. GG. Dang. Okay. Um. That sucks. I still find it funny though that we managed to take out Calyrex Shadow Rider, and then lost to Scarf. Uh, not Scarf Ditto. Life Orb Ditto. This team doesn't know what it wants. It doesn't know what it wants in both modes. Lose to Giratina, and I don't know how they managed to do that. Uh. I can always lead off Giratina and Cinnaroar, bring the Tapu Bulu in the back, and... Reggie like he's fine. Yeah, like... What? One would assume here they would... Protect... Protect and, um... Light screen or spirit break? Yep. My fake out off, get this burn. Please connect. All right, nice. So I don't really have to worry about spirit break anymore. It's really not an issue. Um, matter of fact, I should be able to go into Bulu here and just shadow ball. I'm faster than them. Interesting. They ice beam me. There's pretty much nothing. I know for a fact my Bulu eats that hit. I can go into my Incineroar here, and I'm very willing to Horn Leech. They're not going to Water Spout. They never Water Spout here. They should always Ice Beam the Bulu and fail to KO it. Send in Torkoal. Uh, that's just Parting Shot. That is just parting shot food, which I will take. Parting shot, I'm gonna go hard in my Guarantina. Spirit Rick should never KO me. So their last Pokemon's gotta be Venusaur, right? I would assume their last Pokemon like has to be Venusaur if they got this Torkoal here. As they forget how fake out works, interesting. Um I don't want to save a Leki. Bulu shouldn't die to this. Yeah, Bulu absolutely insane. I'm gonna go ahead and just annihilate this real quick. I'm sick of this Torkoal. I hope this is enough. <laughs> I hope this is enough. It's probably not. It's not enough. I'm dumb. I could have just gone back into my boy. Oh, wait. No, we're fine. Uh, at this point, I should be able to... How much did my Earth Power do? I mean, at minus one special attack. Uh, I can just do this. I can just Volt Switch in the Torkoal and it might KO. Thunderbolt's probably safer. If I lose this, I'm going to be really upset with myself. Because I played, I played awful. I'm gonna keep it with you. I played awful so far. I mean, I have safety goggles and stuff, so this feels like a free flare blitz. I kind of hope they don't earth power. I think I really hope they actually just straight up go for the um the sleep powder and try their luck. Because if I can get rid of this Venusaur, I think I'm pretty safe to win with Aleki. Watch them go freaking Kyogre here for no reason. They try to Sleep Powder the Aleki. Interesting. Yeah, get rid of that. Uh, and I'm feeling pretty good. I think I'm balling once more.
Truly, I am once again bawling. Check this out. Check this out. They'll never see it coming. They'll never see me stay in with Incineroar. They will not understand this play. I really hope they only have Water Spout. That'd be funny. Also, they're Life Orb Kyogre, which is strange. Their Origin Pulse. I just lost. <laughs> I just lost. Uh, How much did my Volt Switch do? 45%. My Electrobe is not KOing, is it? I mean, if they stay in with this... Check this out. If they don't Spirit Break me right now, I win. I think I still win by Thunderbolting repeatedly. Funny enough, because... I think. I think I can still KO the Torkoal from 27%, and Grimmsnarl's not doing that much. Okay. This next turn, I Protect. Because they should just Spirit Break and, um, and Protect themselves. I think Magnet Aleki still KOs here. And that's just a matter of maybe getting a crit. Yep. Please KO still. You're Magnet Aleki, dude. Please KO. I need you right now. If I see that skip to end button, I'm going to cry. On stream. Violently. Okay? And now I know my endgame. Protect. I protect every other turn, and I'm going to be able to possibly win this as long as he doesn't get a crit. I think as long as he doesn't get a crit, I always win. Because a crit, um, a crit spirit break, he only needs one. And I also only need one crit as well, but I think I played better. All right, that reflect made no sense. I always win now. Yeah, the burn's going to put him in range where my next one kills because I did 17% here. Gee. That was interesting. Okay. That was much more frustrating than it should have been. All things considered. <laughs> All things considered, that was that was just I just played irresponsibly. And that's a Hitmonchan. I mean, they literally have like one thing that hits Giratina here, and that's hilarious to me. That's just hilarious to me. I'm gonna go ahead and as long as they're not Scarf, I think I outspeed. Yeah, or as long as long as they're not timid, Scarf, I outspeed. What am I saying? As long as they're not timid and Tailwind, I outspeed. If they're modest in Tailwind, I should. No, no, I always outspeed. What am I saying? Why am I dumb? Am I dumb? Why do I always forget this? I feel like this is so obvious, and I'm just always forgetting it. I think even if they're timid. Because Kingdra is faster than this, and it's a speed tie at, at uh, level 50. Yeah, 150. Yeah, I'm faster. What am I saying? No, I'm not. 300. Marcus, why are you bad at math right now? Okay, I'm just going to lead off Giratina, Regieleki, Tapu Bulu, and we'll do Incineroar again. Why am I so bad at math? I'm literally a physics major. Okay, you ready for this? Ooh, is he going to fake out the Regieleki? Ooh. Is he going to Tailwind? Is he going to Taunt? Okay, that was actually big. <laughs> that was actually big, I can't lie. Alright, um, I mean, I should still be able to Volt Switch here. Does his base speed 140? Uh, as long as he's not jolly, I'm fine. I can go into Bulu. Yep. Hitmonchan's gone. Use a fighting move. Aha! Alright, goodbye. Got one KO. We got one KO. That's all I need. That's all I need to be happy. I lied. I need so much more to be happy. I don't know why he's got both grass types. Commit to something, dude. Commit to something. Oh, hey, triple axel incoming. Woo.
Too bad you triple axle the wrong Pokemon. Uh, let me go ahead and assuming he's gonna taunt again. Assuming he's gonna taunt again. I should take the high jump kick. I'm just gonna Shadow Ball Flare Blitz because once Tailwind's gone, he loses. This might still KO. Yeah, this KOs. That should be game. Uh, he runs out of Tailwind next turn. I just have to intimidate this thing one more time. I focus this thing. I'm gonna parting shot. Like I don't care if I lose my incinerator this early. Do I? I feel like Tapu Bulu is better for this job, anyways. Uh, maybe I'm stupid. Maybe I'm stupid. I'll go Bulu. Play rough. That does not KO me. All right, good damage. Good damage. Good. Are you kidding me? Come back. Come back, internet. Come back. No, not an empty room. Come back. What happened? There we go. Okay. <laughs> Crisis averted. I was really upset there. Um. I'll do this. That's fine. I'm still streaming, right? Yeah, I'm still streaming. My entire GUI for OBS is gone. <laughs> My entire GUI for OBS has just disappeared for some reason. You always do this. Yep, that'll KO this thing. And GG's. GG's, yeah. Uh, Thunderbolt. Yeah. yeah Thanks I'm for good. the sub. Was up, Moxie? One win away with the boys to go to Ultra Tier and Unite. Good luck testing Giratina. You're going to need it. Oh my god, Giratina is so bad. And good luck, man. Good luck. I think I'm going to go ahead and... I don't think Stack's a terrible play here. But Urshfu also isn't bad. We'll do that. It is Urshfu Dark. How unfortunate. How unfortunate. Why does he just defeat us here? Why did he just win? Uh, I can go Reggie Lucky here and try to parting shot. Just gonna Wicked Blow. Follow me, yeah. Yeah, bro, I just, I just lose. Yeah, I just, I just lost to the, the one Dark Urshifu. <laughs> Doesn't do much. Nice. One. Two. Three. I wish I brought Tapu Bulu because he's a hard wall to this. I really wish I brought Tapu Bulu. Uh, maybe he'll let me... <laughs> maybe he'll let me Earth Power him and that might KO. He's not going to let me. I'm just going to say that. Yeah, there it is. Your game. Your routine of trash. Your routine of trash. Goodbye. Giratina Urshfu actually isn't bad. And we're in the back. Stack. Yeah. Seems alright. There's the Lando lead. I wanted to see that. That's exactly what I wanted to see. And I can just go for the Shadow Ball here. Protect. Because he has no Shadow Ball switch-ins on the, on the Lando. And Lando doesn't do anything to Giratina. Like, the worst I can take is, like, a, a Rock Slide or a Stone Edge. Wheezy, how you doing? We're using a bad Pokemon today. I would say their play is probably going to be like fake out into Urshifu plus Earth Power because that should always get rid of it. And if I can get this damage off on the Landers, I'll be happy because next turn I just Surging Strikes. They Sludge Bomb me, expecting that to do something. 
And they parting shot me, expecting that to do something. I know for a fact I tank one hit from this, um... From the station. Here's the Rillaboom. I'll take it. Uh, I'll Will-O-Wisp this thing, and I'll go hard into... Incineroar, because I think I'd rather keep the Urshifu in this matchup. Because I'm getting Earth Powered. Or maybe I just... Do I KO from this range? I don't KO from this range. Maybe I just... I'm going to try to Aqua Jet, but it's not going to do... Actually, my job becomes like 90% your 90% a number I pulled out my butt there. If I just get rid of Lando by like Aqua Jet plus Shadow Ball. But I know I'm about to get faked out anyways. I think Stack's the most expendable Pokemon. That's fine. I can will o -Wisp. Go and send here. Uh, if I get this burn on Zacian, that'd be great. I'm mostly scared of Lando, honestly. As I opt not to switch out, so I should just burn this thing as long as I connect. Please connect. Nice, okay. They should nerf for the rest of the game. You can't knock off the Grisius Orb. Stupid. Stupid! Alright, um, and I should just be able to fake out here. Stupid! Won't let you get the chance. I can also Flare Blitz just to get rid of it. To protect, that's fine. Give me this Willow Wisp on the Rillaboom. Oh yeah, it's all coming together. Where's the Incineroar? Um, really don't fear this. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna Parting Shot the Zacian. And Earth Power. Because I think the worst that happens is I get faked out on my Incineroar. Because I probably don't lose it this turn, considering I burned it. Yeah, no, I'm going to get the Parting Shot off. And the Earth Power. Awesome. Snarl? Pff, don't care. I do not care. I simply do not care. Uh, this guy is not going to have a good time if I do this. Go hard into Incineroar. Surging strikes the... This guy. Am I play? I'm just gonna go into Rillaboom. I don't want to surging strikes this uh, Zacian and just get rid of it. Yeah, because he's gonna go into Rillaboom here. As he does not, he just he would have let me have that. That was ugh, dang. I'm so upset. I could have just taken it from him. I always hate those plays when you like think you can just get something for free and you can't. I mean, the Rillaboom's burned, and I can just parting shot and protect. It's it's not the end of the world. Really, I think the game's pretty much sealed once this Incineroar, or once this, um, yeah, once this Incineroar is gone, the game's pretty much sealed. He Flare Blitzes me, does not get the KO. All right, uh, and I kind of have a pin here. Yeah, I kind of a pin on his team. He has to give me the, the Landorus or the Incineroar. He has to choose. And neither one's looking great for him, so I just double into it here. Neither option's great for my opponent. Support chance he's the real play, though. <laughs> yeah, I did like nothing. Give me that. One. Two. Three. He is not Figgy Berry burped and he always has to give me Lando here he has no way of avoiding giving me Lando yeah because I go for the aqua jet and then I go for the shadow ball and then you lose to the stack attack you cannot protect me or you cannot protect from me I feel like the one appeal my channel has is I'm pretty much willing to use anything but I won't use it in like a way that kind of sucks. 
I'll probably find a way to make it where it like doesn't seem that awful. And I think I've done that with Giratina here. But when I play stupid, dang, I play stupid. <laughs> when I start to play stupid, it's bad. It gets real bad, real quick. People unsubscribe and I don't even blame them. I'm like, I would too. I can go, uh, I can go a Leky stack and give him a bit of an ultimatum. Definitely want Incineroar in the back, but it's going to be scary with this thing. Uh, maybe I'll go Bulu. No, I go Incineroar Giratina. Okay, yeah, no, this, this lead's actually pretty great for me. This lead's pretty great, because I just protect and I go Giratina here, and he has to give me Mian Xiao next turn. <laughs> he straight up has to give me the Mian Xiao. It's, it, that's, it's funny here. Unless he has, like, Hypnosis. Unless he has Hypnosis, he has to give me Mian Xiao. Because they don't... I don't think they care to protect. They have Wide Guard, Fake Out, High Jump Kick, and Faint. There's the Coil. Uh, don't care. I'm going to Volt Switch into whatever I feel like, man. And... I can also just double this Milotic. But it's mostly the, the Mian Xiao that's giving me issues. Yeah, nice. I have successfully taken away their Mian Xiao and Ooh, there's really no right choice here, is there? I'm going to get high jump kicked. I suppose I can bank on a miss. There was no right choice there. There was straight up no right choice. <laughs> I guess the right choice was not to be so weak to this thing. I mean, if I electrowebbed, I would have gotten the KO as well, but I didn't know they were going to protect. Makes it a bit scarier to click, you know? Just a bit, just a bit scarier. An Electrobe Shadow Ball. I have to Electrobe Shadow Ball. That sucks. I get a Spit F drop. No Spit F drop. Um, they might be in range of another Thunderbolt if I don't lose this thing. I think they're in range. Let me think. So my Electroweb did. Decent amount. Decent amount, all things considered. I'm going to double protect here. Just in case I protect one of these things. It doesn't gleam. Okay. They muddy water. And I have to Thunderbolt. Battle Ball. <laughs> Please KO. Okay, I got a crit. That's pretty big. Don't get the spit off drop. Okay. Alecky lives, so that's big. I might have just cheesed this game. If there's a Moltres in the back, I've absolutely cheesed. I absolutely cheesed this game. 100% cheddar. 100% cheddar. I cannot tell a lie. This game is just cheese. Protect the Milotic? Yeah, there it is. Okay. 100% cheddared this game into the ground. I can even bolt switch the Milotic here. Battle Ball just to be safe. Raid a cheddar right there. And I was just, next turn I just, I, I mean I click like Fake Out Thunderbolt and then I click like Flare Blitz Electroweb. Or Flare Blitz Thunderbolt next turn. Yeah. Now I just win. I don't, I don't I'm gonna say GG if he says it, but I'm not gonna say it if he doesn't. Because I don't I don't <laughs> they cheese that game so hard. Okay, alright, goodbye. <laughs> Should be able to just go Giratina Aleki here. They have they have a fake out mon, but if I protect, there's like nothing they can do about it. Uh in the back, Bulu's looking absolutely phenomenal. And I'm kind of like an Incineroar, but it's also kind of bad here. I'll just go Urshifu. Yeah, check this out. The double protect. Whatever shall he do? 
Whatever shall he do in the face of this here double protect? I want to say if he's willing to do that, he's probably Scarf. You got to be Scarf on this team. There's no way you're not Scarf. So I'm going to Volt Switch on that Kyogre. And also Shadow Ball it. Or I guess I could Volt Switch the Ludicolo and Shadow Ball and just go into my Tabu Bulu and that's probably safer. Yeah, okay. Glad I did that. Do about half. Go into the Bool. Go into the Bool. Is he Weather Balls me? Expecting that to... I mean, that's a cool move and all, but... Come on, man. Like, get your act together. Horn Leech this thing. Uh, Bulu should survive both hits, I think. Yeah, especially if you're targeting Giratina here. Especially if you double the Giratina. Literally Scald would have done more. Give me this. Nice. And uh, I'll call that a win. I'm going to call that a win here. I'll w, in fact. <laughs> Hello, Choice Band. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Choice Band. Haven't seen you in a while. Uh, yeah, that's game. Good game. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. That's something to be almost proud of. No. Don't let me get slapped around by a Stunfisk. Yes, I don't have to waste points. <laughs> Stunfisk. Ladies and gentlemen, let, let us show him what the heck is up. Let us show him what the heck is up. Yeah, because if I lead off Reggie Lucky, there's a 100% chance he's going to fake out into it. Let us show him what the heck is up, Kyle. Um, I'll take it. Should be able to bolt switch here out into my Incin. Be specs? Don't be specs. He's not. Okay. So I can snarl here and I can go into stack. Stack attack attack attack? Of the stack attack attack clan? Going to Giratina. Probably will -O -S this thing. I'm going to Will-O-Wisp, but it just seems very smart to do that right now. And I need to keep Incinera alive, so I'm willing to get rid of Regieleki to trade for this Will-O-Wisp. Nice. I'm going to get in my Incineroar. Take out you. Earth Power you. Probably AV. Not AV. That's fine. Um, It doesn't KO me. He, I, he did 40%. That's actually kind of... That's somewhat concerning. Alright. I'm gonna reverse the trick room. Actually, is the trick room benefiting me? Probably isn't. I, I think I'm better off just going for rock slide flinches. Yeah, I don't care. Oh, that actually did a decent amount. Fake out Shadow Ball. Actually, check this out. Fake out Earth Power.
If I can tank one. Oh no, I don't. He's at plus one. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. And I also didn't kill. Dang, that is that's gonna be like max special. Oh no, he shook a berry. I'm stupid. GG's. Dang, okay. That Stunfisk actually styled on me. That Stunfisk actually styled um, on me. Ursula is something I haven't really had to deal with yet. But I'm also not entirely sure how to go forward with facing this team. If I lead off Giratina or Regieleki, that seems relatively safe. And the back stack attack, it seems very nice. And I think I have to go with my... Urshifu safe. Yeah, I'll take it. Double protect here. Double protect. Uh, next turn, I should be able to... I mean, he's not going to stand with Solgaleo, is he? He could trick room. He could actually trick room with Solgaleo. But he should fake out a lucky. Oh, he sun still strikes. Um, I don't agree with that play. Like, under any circumstances. I think this will do it. I think this will do it. Unless he's like AV, then, then it's not. Maybe it will. Yeah, he's not AV. This will do it. The Snarl. Feeling good, feeling good. If Rillaboom comes out, we will a wisp. Where's the Arachnid? Can't burn it. Can't burn it. Um. Guess I'll just go for damage. It gives me the Incineroar. Likely. No, that's like full fizz def, dude. That's straight up full fizz def. I mean, he's got to give me something. If he didn't go into Rillaboom there, I'm assuming he just doesn't have it. Yeah, he just forfeits. Yeah, if you if you didn't bring Rillaboom there, that's why. 